I could already tell this guy was going to be strange. Hey there, Am Amanda. Amanda, hey. Uh, oh, no, no, no. You're in the driver's seat today. Oh, hey. I just thought I was already ready for this to be over. <laughs> the dude on his side. Uh, well, you're in the driver's seat. Do you know what it means to be a driver? Um, I think so. This is my driving instructor. It means that you are in control. Drivers don't think so. They know so. There's a dangerous road out there. We're going to chew you up, spit you out, and set you on fire. Is this dude for real? But that's why we have these classes, right? So you feel confident enough to face your impending death. So at this point, I realized I was dealing with a full-fledged psychopath. You're in control of your own fate today, Amanda. You are the driver. I am the driver. Oh, why do you say that with me? Say, I am the driver today. I am the driver? You fucking idiot. What's the first thing that you do when you get in the car? Depends on who's in the passenger seat. Uh, um, turn it on. <laughs> Amanda, do you really think you're ready to turn on the car yet? I'm really ready to punch you in the face. I think so. Not with those nerves, you're not. No siree. No, the first thing you want to do when you get in the car is take a deep breath. Okay. Now, with me. <sighs> but really, someone get this guy a mint stat. Don't you feel a little bit more relaxed? Yeah, I think so. I feel a little bit better. Good, Amanda. That's real good. Now, I want you to make sure you can see out of your rear and side mirrors. Looks like I'm still stuck here with you. You're doing great, Amanda. Now, you must... What the fuck was that called again? Click it or take it? That's very good, Amanda. Remember, a safety belt can mean the difference between severe head trauma and a broken clavicle. Wait, what? Severe head trauma? Now you're ready to turn on the car. You must remember to relax. I was relaxed. Are you relaxed yet? I'm fine. You don't sound relaxed. I am relaxed. Could we just please start this? I just want to go home. When it comes down to it, if you're going to crash into a divider in the parkway doing 90 miles an hour, which, by the way, you should never be doing, you're probably going to die. What the actual fuck? Okay, I'm sorry, but why would you say something like that? I now want you to turn on the car. <laughs> Shit, is that a person? Well, fuck you, dude! That definitely was a person. Oh my god, oh. I'm so sorry. I definitely did not sign up for all of this. Are you fucking kidding me? Do you see a crosswalk anywhere? Do you see anywhere in the vicinity of this whole street a sign that says, oh, you can walk wherever the fuck you want? I don't feel like I'm gonna make it home. The most important thing to do while driving is to just take a chill pill. I know that there's more car crashes a year in the United States than there are plane crashes or overdoses combined. Doesn't make me an expert. This clipboard does though. You're scaring me. Do you have anxiety? You know, you'd be a really cool kid if you just lightened up. You want some? Fuck it, I am done. You handle a lot of very high stretch situations very well. I'm really impressed. Alright, see you next session. Bye!